I guess I should do a little introduction. My name is Nate. I live in Brooklyn, New York, and I recently quit my decently dependable, somewhat stable job to see if I can make a living on my bike as a messenger in New York City. And then I thought, why not film it? For all three of you. And my mom. Let's do it. I'd like to take the train into the city. So I got on the L train and it's not going to the city today. It stops at Bedford Avenue, which is the last stop in Brooklyn. So I'm walking over to the Williamsburg Bridge and we'll cross over into the city. It is luckily a beautiful day out today, so a little bit more time in the sun, a little bit more time outside. city and I'm a little bit early and I'm hungry I haven't eaten anything yet today I'm gonna go get a dollar slice Two slices on a Coke. Thank you.
livery that's going into Queens. And it's like wine and liquor. So I'm gonna go pick that up. There it is. Thank you much, man. Right, Have a good one. I don't mind going to Queens sometimes. It's actually pretty nice. The only thing that kind of sucks about it is you have to cross a bridge. Let's do it. Thank you. boxes of 100 whippets. So it's gonna be 32660. Yep. I can confidently say this is the heaviest delivery I've ever done. 500 whippets? I'm about to fall off the back of my bike. I guess technically I can say I deliver drugs. It'll make an excellent clickbait for the title of my video. Nate delivers drugs. Click here. Let's see. Is that right? shift is technically ending at 9 so I think this will be my last delivery I am going to end up in the Upper East Side at the very top corner of Central Park so I have to come all the way back down probably 2nd Avenue and then cross the Williamsburg Bridge but yeah that'll be the end of the night
For three. Three, two dollars. Thank you. Subway churro. Do not recommend. Thank you very much. People keep asking me, what are you going to do about winter? This. Do you order deliveries in the summer? What are you going to do about ordering deliveries in the winter? People are going to be delivering in the winter. Raw oatmeal. I mean, I'm probably not going to be working when it's snowing outside. My bike can't handle that. But, put some gloves on, put a hat on, thick coat, scarf, face mask. Go out there. As long as the streets are dry, I can do deliveries. The streets don't necessarily have to be dry either. Just can't really have snow or ice on the ground. And after it snows, it's cleared up within hours. Yeah, I can do deliveries during the winter. Now mostly I'll be working during the evenings, but that's not because there's more deliveries during the evenings or there's not many deliveries in the mornings. I just can't wake up. I complain about my sleep, my sleep schedule being completely I'll stay up all night staring at a computer screen, go to bed at like 6, 7 a.m., wake up at like 2 or 3 every day now. Most of my deliveries are pretty boring. Usually it's food. Actually, yeah, 85% of what I deliver is food. But every once in a while, you'll get a delivery that makes for a great story. In fact, that's what made me start bringing my camera out and filming it. There was this one time I got a dispatch and it just said envelope. I was like, alright, I'll go get this envelope. And when I got to the pickup, there was a guy, and he had this super gnarly, massive, I believe it was like an engagement ring. And he was like, here you go, give it to me in a little bag. And he said, deliver this to whatever address. Actually, you know what? I suck at telling stories.